Family Memorial Day weekend sale here in TLC Garden Centers. It's TLC Live. We may not have red, white, and blue here, but we have a lot of pink periwinkles. Brandy's here to tell us all about it. It is a sea of periwinkles. It is. It's <laughs> finally getting warm enough for periwinkles, and we've got a plenty to choose from in every, every color, every size. Mm -hmm. um, they may not like the rain we're getting right now, but once <laughs> it dries out, they'll be great. Full sun, some sun. What are we talking here? full sun definitely and they like to go dry oh no kidding okay so you, you need to find a spot that's higher up so that may, maybe it won't be so saturated that would be a great thing for them yeah they then they don't like sprinklers so it's, it's an area that you can hand water it do even better okay let's talk about all the sales we got going on here with lots of sales for memorial day weekend we do it's going to be a big weekend um the nursery's got plenty of sales we've got vegetables on sale in here so mm -hmm. there's gonna be a lot to choose from Okay, so let's go from periwinkles to our vegetable gardens. We've got tons of peppers and tomatoes. We've still got some melons and, and squash and stuff like that. Yeah, absolutely. And when you get it in the ground, what do you need to do? What do you need to know? I guess fertilize, right? Definitely. Fertilize is one of the biggest things, especially with the rain we're getting right now. Mm -hmm. You need to make sure that if you've already got it in the ground that you're fertilizing um, and then making sure that you're watering correctly throughout the season. Once we get warm, mm -hmm. you got to be thoroughly saturating them when you're watering them so that it's getting all the way down to the bottom of the roots. Okay, anything we can do to keep the pests away? So it's just with that kind of stuff, it's kind of watching as you're going. Um, there's not a preventative you can do, but, mm -hmm. you know, keeping an eye on them every couple of days and making sure you're not having some aphid or worm issues and stuff like that. Sure. And if you do get those, come talk to y'all. Definitely. Yeah, we've got stuff to choose from that's organic to use on them. Mm -hmm. um, and then we can just help you with whatever problems you're having. For the bigger pests, get a dog. <laughs> you could do that. Yeah, definitely. Um, you know, the, the biggest thing is get probably going to be worms, especially oh, okay. when we start drying out some. Mm -hmm. And so just watching. Yeah, but I really love the idea of having a homegrown vegetable garden because it's so convenient and it really does save you money. It does. It does. I mean, it, it can be some work, but yeah, true. but I mean, when you're you're picking it and you're eating it right there, it's great. Yeah, it's very gratifying. Um, I think it's really cool for children to see that that's where the food comes from, too. It is definitely. And, that, and that's yeah. one of the simple, simplest things to get them attracted to plants is, you know, teaching them how they can grow their own vegetables. And maybe they'll eat more. That's right. Yeah. And getting to eat some more vegetables too. Yes. You know, I love hibiscus. I absolutely adore hibiscus. I plant it everywhere and you got a lot of them here. We do. We have plenty to choose from right now. We've got a good selection of them mm -hmm. um, pretty much in every color and singles and doubles mm -hmm. and just a great plant that'll bloom all summer long. Absolutely. And some stand a little taller, some are a little shorter. So it's really what you want. Yeah. We've got the bush form and the tree forms and we've even got the trees and braided. Oh so gosh. we've got a lot to choose from. Absolutely. Let's talk about the pots and boxes for Memorial Day as well. Yes. We've got plenty to choose from right now. We're making them every day so that you can take them out to the cemetery and decorate how you, however you'd like. Yeah. That's really nice with the flags and everything. We do. Yeah. We've got flags in them and we, and we can make them without flags and we can do them on special requests. All right, Randy, thank you so much. Thanks for being with us, everybody. We'll see you here for Memorial Day weekend and we'll see you next time on TLC Live.